everybody! I'm Eve the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today I'm hanging out with some of Old McDonald's sheep. Come on! So, we've only got two sheep in the pen here. The blue sheep and the pink sheep because the rest of them ran away. And I'm going to go out and find them. You guys are safe here. We've got uh, a really tall fence and a gate that is definitely closed. So you guys shouldn't be able to get out. I'm going to go and find your friends now, okay? Don't worry. I'll be back soon, all right? And all the ponies are here, so let's head out. Hmm, let's see. We've already found the pink sheep. And there's a couple green sheep. Let's follow the, the orange trail. Let's see where it goes. So it's heading over this way. And, oh, he's going right over the bridge here. All right, well... Let's hope we can find him. My friend Bo Peep really likes the orange sheep. She uses it to make a, a bunch of her clothing. Oh, hi, Mr. Piggy. Did you see where the orange sheep went? Or, or Mr. Cow, did you? Huh. Well, oh, man. The trail leads right up to this portal. And there's nothing behind the portal. Oh, man, I think that means the orange sheep jumped through. Oh, no. We don't know what could be on the other side. I hope the orange sheep is okay. Well, we got to jump through the portal and go after it. Okay, well, here I go. Whoa, I'm in some sort of hallway. I wonder where that portal took me. Look, there's a lever here and, oh, there's like some sort of big pit. Oh man, well, maybe the lever will open up a door or maybe a bridge or something that can help me uh, get through. Okay, let's see what happens. I don't see anything. Oh, oh no! Water! Oh, it's pushing me right to the edge! Oh! Ah, ow! That hurt! Oh man, well, I guess I'm okay. I'm not I'm not dead, so that's good. So let's uh whew, let's see. Yeah, I, I look okay. Nothing's broken, so let's uh let's head on forward and see. Oh! Did you guys see that? Oh man! I, I stepped on this this uh pressure plate and oh! Oh, it shot out an arrow at me. That was close. Well, I better be careful and try not to, to step on any more. I don't want to get, get stuck with any arrows now. So let's be careful. And be, oh, oh, oops. Okay. Well, oh, man. There's lava up ahead. Oh, dear. Well, I better be careful. Oh, I'm going to have to jump across all these stones. How, how did the orange sheep make it all the way across? Well, let's, uh... Let's get a running start and go for it. And it looks like to, to get a running start, I'm gonna have to jump over this, or run over this pe pressure plate. Well, I'm gonna give it a shot. Let's hope that uh, if it's an arrow, I can outrun it, all right? Okay, oh, here I go, and jump! Oh, 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 I made it, guys, I made it, I'm okay, I'm okay! And it, it looks like that didn't throw out any sort of arrow. It looks like I got hit with a potion. Let's see. A fire resistance potion. Oh, that was really lucky. Okay. So I'm going to jump to the next stone. Let's let's hope I can make it. Okay, okay. And uh, oh, I'm kind of scared, guys. But I really got to make it across for, for the sheep. For all the sheep. Not just the orange sheep. Okay. Here I go. Ready, set, and jump. Oh, 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 I jumped too far. Oh, man. Oh, oh, I'm on fire. Oh, get it off. Get it off. Oh, stop, trap, and roll. Stop, trap, and roll. Oh, well, wait a minute. I'm not getting hurt. Oh, that's what the fire resistance must do. It must keep me from being hurt from the fire. Well, hopefully it stops burning. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, I look totally fine. This is awesome. That potion was super cool. Well, I really don't want to get lit on fire again, so I'm still going to be careful about jumping across okay so we'll do a quick jump here oh phew i made it that time okay let's jump over to this one and jump oh phew we made it okay so we'll jump to this one. Oh man oh that's a lot of lava that's probably where all of the uh the the lava here was coming from uh, the, in that roof there let's jump over here okay let's be really careful not to touch it and oh whoo i made it by that was close and oh did you guys hear that? I heard the sheep. <gasps> Looks like the sheep must have set off all these traps. Oh, oh, oh no, even more fell now. Oh man. Well, okay, let's be careful here. Let's dig through all this sand. Oh, it keeps falling. Okay, let's, let's dig our way out here. Okay, there we go. Oh, it keeps falling. Let's 
keep going. There we go, I should be able to get by. Man, that silly sheep. I can't believe it set off that trap there with the lava. And, and even the sand trap, just like me. Okay, let's be careful now. Uh, sheepy, are you in there? Sheepy, sheepy. There you are, we found you, we found you. Oh man, how'd you make it through all those obstacles? And Oh, be careful though, sheepy. Get away from that. Oh man, one of the ones I stood in front of before had arrows coming out of it. And another one gave me a, a special potion, but we don't know what these do. Let's uh, pull the lever and find out. Now be careful, I don't want you getting hurt. Huh. Oh, that one gave me a cake! Oh, look at that! Oh man, let's let's have some cake when we get back to the farm, all right? But first, we gotta open this uh, other one here. Okay, be careful, sheepy. And let's see. Oh, more cake! Oh, now I have two cakes, one for both of us. Isn't that exciting, orange sheep? Well, well, let's head home here. I uh, I want to make sure that you get home safe. So let's put you on a lead and head back out. Okay. Well. We could go back the way we came, but I didn't see a way out. All that, all there is is this portal here. Oh man, it's kind of scary, but yeah, I think you're right, Orange Sheep. We should jump through it. It's really important to be able to overcome our fears, especially if it means getting you home to our other sheep friends. So far, I've managed to find the pink and the blue sheep, but don't worry, I'll collect our whole family of colored sheep soon. Come on, let's go! Okay, let's hope it brings us back to the farm. Here I go. Oh, oh man. Looks like I made it through okay. Oh boy. Sheepy, what, where, where did the sheepy go? We made it back to the farm, but I don't see our sheep friend. Sheepy, oh, there he is. He must have come out on the wrong side. Don't worry, orange sheep. I'm gonna help you, don't worry. Ah, uh, Eep's here to help. Okay, let's uh. Come on, sheepy. Come on, let's go. Up this way. Come on, sheepy. You can get out. There we go. Okay, let's head out back to Old McDonald's Farm. You can hang out with your friends there, and we can have some of this delicious cake. Okay, let's stay away from that portal. I don't want you going in there again. Oh, it's pretty spooky. I'm going to have to tell Old McDonald that we need to get rid of that. We can't have any more sheep or other farm animals ending up in that weird obstacle course, you know? Come on, Sheepy, it's okay. All right, just heading across the bridge. Man, Sheepy, you, you are uh, shedding a lot of wool. We should uh, give you a shear sometime soon. Let's see, there we go. You coming, Sheepy? That's a good boy, who's a good sheep? All right, so we're back at the barn. Let's put you back in the pen and then I'll, we can have some cake. Okay, let's see. We're gonna open this and bring you in. Come on, Sheepy. Come on, you can make it, let's go. There we go. And uh, yeah, and you're here with your uh, brother and sister, the pink and the blue sheep. They're really excited to see you. Okay guys, we're gonna have some cake now. And you know, let's share it with the other sheep too. There we go, cake for everybody. Oh, you don't stand in cake, you silly sheepy. Oh, oh well, good thing we have two. Let's put another one out, there we go. Oh, I just love cake, but I'm not that hungry right now. Well, I'm glad you're okay, orange sheep. Oh yeah, you're excited about the cake. Well, I'm gonna get out of the pen and close the gate. You guys should be okay. Oh, you're so excited to be home. Oh, this is great. Well, looks like I found three sheep so far. Oh, well thanks for playing with me today, guys. Without your help, I couldn't have found the orange sheep. Come again soon and we can play some more Minecraft. Bye, bye. Everybody, I'm Eat the Mouse, and today we're playing Putt Putt. I want to go home. As you can hear, this giraffe really wants to go home, so let's see if we can help him out with this stuck drawbridge. Let's start by pressing on the rock that's in the way. Oh, it seems pretty stuck. I can't reach it from over here. Oh man, and it's too far. Okay, well let's let's see. There's this this pulley that leads to the drawbridge. Let's try that. It's coming down. Oh. This drawbridge will never close if that rock is in the way. Yeah, so I guess we have to find a way to move the rock. Well, what about the water? Oh, a little fishy. Hmm. What about these plants? Oh, hi! Oh, well, that was pretty funny. I already talked to the giraffe. 
I wish that old drawbridge would shut. Me too. Well, I'm going to figure it out, Mr. Giraffe. Don't worry. Uh, what about the rope? Oh, no, it's just the same thing. I'm sorry. This drawbridge will never close if that rock is in yeah. the way. Okay, well, I'm going to head out and see if I can find something to move the rock. I'll be back. Okay, let's see. Well, let's, let's go the other way. I haven't been yet. Maybe there'll be something over there we can use. <gasps> There's a snake. Peterito, my little Peter. Where can he be? Oh, no. Let's talk to this snake here. Oh, where is my baby? Oh, little Peter, where are you? This must be the baby snake's mom. Hello. Oh, she's yes, crying. I'm Putt Putt, and I'm looking for the baby animal. Oh, little Putt Putt. Oh. Have you found my little Peter? No. I miss him so oh, much. She's it crying. makes me weep. Oh, that's I so haven't sad. found him yet, but I'll keep my eyes open. Oh, we gotta work really hard. I can't. Thank you. I don't like sad oh, animals. A good little car oh. with a good little heart. Oh. I can tell. Thanks. Thanks, Mrs. Boa. We we try to be as as nice as we can. Well, let's let's press on this speaker and see what that's about. Now we can find out all about boa constrictors. Oh, boa constrictors live in Central America and South America. Ooh, interesting. That's pretty cool. I wonder if it'll tell me something else. Oh, I boas prefer to live in the dampness of the rainforest. Oh, cool. Let's see what if it's got another fact. Because boas are slow-moving snakes, they only need to eat about one meal a week. Oh. So if they're slow, so they don't have to eat that much. Man, I love eating so much, I don't know if I could do oh, that. Oh, I miss my Peterito. Oh, don't, don't worry, Mrs. Snake. We'll, we'll get your, your, your baby soon. Okay, let's see. Wow. I wonder how I can get up that river. I sure can't swim. I mean, your car, I don't think you could swim at all. Well, let's see what this is. Hey, it's a raft. It doesn't look very put together. Oh, Pip! Oh, oh no, no Pip. Pip! Oh, it's okay. I got you. Oh. If that wrap doesn't hold up Pep, it's sure not going to hold up me. Yeah. Unless I fix it first. Right. But I guess we don't have anything to fix it with. Oh, man. Ooh. That's pretty. I guess we can't head out anyway, and we don't have anything to fix it with. That's pretty funny, though. Does this make a noise? Oh, cool. Oh, <laughs> okay, well, I don't think there's anything else in this jungle I can do right now, so I guess we'll head out this way. May maybe we can check out a different area? Maybe there'll be something else? I hope I'm not missing anything around here. Bye, rhyming monkeys! I'll see you later! Okay, we'll go... Oh, I have to swing over like that monkey did. All right! <laughs> that was pretty cool. Let's check out the grasslands next. Maybe there's something there that I can use to fix that raft and help our giraffe friend. Let's see. Whoa. Oh, is this a log? <gasps> Ooh. Oh, that's perfect. That's a log. Yeah. I could definitely use that to fix the, 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 um, the raft to see if I can help the giraffe. But, um, let's check everything else out here first. It says... Observation point. That's pretty cool. Can we see everything? Wow. I can see all of the grassland. It's beautiful. It is super pretty. You're right, Putt-Putt. And look at all the animals. There are zebras. Oh. Oh, whoa, and he hit that fly right out of the sky. All right, let's head this way. Maybe we can meet some of the animals down by the watering hole. Oh, wow, look at all these animals. It says watering hole. That's so cool. Let's, let's see if we can meet anybody. What are these guys? Oh, the peacocks ran away. Oh, man. Well, maybe this bird will say hello. He looks like a stork. How's about a game of animal tag? Animal tag? Yeah, let's play animal tag. Way to go, sport. Oh, oh no, they're all gone. How hard do you want this game to be? Oh, man. Easy, medium, or hard? Hmm. Let's play on medium and see how it goes. Medium it is. Okay. Round 10. 10. Now try and find five flamingos. Five flamingos. And 10 peacocks. 10 peacocks. Oh, man. Well, that's one flamingo. That's two flamingos. 
Oh, that's a peacock. So that's one peacock. That's the third flamingo. And the fourth flamingo. We need one more. That's the second peacock. Oh, that's the last flamingo. Awesome. Oh, that's not a flamingo or a peacock. Oh, neither is that. Oh, but that's a peacock. Oh, that's a zebra. Hi, zebra. Oh, and another zebra. Too bad I'm not looking for zebras. And I already have all the flamingos I need. So, I guess that's fine. Another zebra. And a flamingo. Uh, oh, and here we go. There's a peacock. Oh, and another peacock. We need five more. Oh, only four left. Oh, that's not a peacock. I almost clicked on it, guys. Oh, there we go. Three more peacocks. Not a cheetah. Not a flamingo. But, nope, not another flamingo. I need a peacock. Oh, there it is. Okay, two left. Nope. How many? Oh, there's another one. Okay, we need one more. And there it is! We got awesome them all! Awesome job you're doing there! Yay! Uh, round 11. Find six cheetahs. Oh, man. And six zebras. Okay, okay. Well, uh, Flamingo was last round. And that's a cheetah. Oh, bye! Oh, and that's a zebra. I did! Oh, that's neither. Okay. Oh. And another zebra. Another zebra. And, oh, that's that's neither. That's not a cheetah. Oh, but that's a cheetah. Oh, I clicked his spots off. Okay. Oh, there's another cheetah. <laughs> so silly. And, uh, how many left? Oh, another cheetah. We need one more cheetah. Oh, and there he is. And, oh, that's not a zebra. Oh, and that's not a zebra either. Okay. Oh, give me some zebras! Oh, so many cheetahs now! Wow, that's a lot of cheetahs, but we don't need... Oh, but there's a zebra! Hey, got me. Yeah! Okay, two more zebras! Oh. Hey, got okay, me. one left! One more! Just another zebra! There he is! Hey, got me. Awesome. awesome job you're doing there! Yay! Oh, but I, I don't think I... I now, I try and find... Six rhinos. Okay, I, and seven gazelles. I'd love to play, but I really gotta uh, go. You sure you gotta go? Yeah, I'm sorry. I hope to see you again. I, I gotta find and save all the other animals. Okay, let's, uh, oh, but look, there are rhinos here. Oh, and they're all running away. Okay, well, let's keep going. <sighs> oh, an elephant. All I want is my baby Jumbo. Oh, no, this must be another mom. Excuse me, are you baby Jumbo's mother? Oh. Yes, honey, She's I She's crying, am. too. My heart is oh, breaking because it's landing on putt -Putt. <laughs> Are you the fellow who's helping to find the baby animal? Yeah, that's us. I sure am. Oh, wonderful. I have a feeling you're going to find my Jumbo. I'm going to try my hardest. Me too, Mama Mabatha. Wish me luck. Okay. Good luck, putt, -Putt. Okay, we're gonna do our best. Let's keep going. Oh man, a seal! Hey! Mommy! <gasps> hey! You must be Sammy Seal. What happened? Oh no! I was having a great time splishing and splashing. I like swimming too. All of too. a sudden, the dam closed. Oh no! Now I'm stuck. <gasps> oh no! Maybe I can help. Yeah! Oh boy! Oh, yeah. Sammy's so happy. I bet if we figure out a way to open the dam, you could swim home. Of course I could. Oh, man. I'm a super duper swimmer extraordinaire. Oh, that's awesome. I'm glad that this seal knows how to swim. Well, let's see. This is the dam. I need to find something to help me lower the dam. Okay. What's this? I need to find something to help me lower oh, the dam. That's a really interesting shape. It kind of reminds me of, of these you know guys. Yeah! Oh, okay. So, one of these shapes is the right one, I think. This kind of looks like the shape of, of that, so let's try it. All right. And we're going to put it right here. It's... Yeah! We got it, guys! And look, the dam's going down! Get ready, Sammy! You're going swimming! Yay! Yeah! I'm flipping out of flapping! Oh, this Sammy's so happy! Fun. Hurry home, Sammy Seal! <gasps> and good luck! Good luck, Sammy! Uh, he's heading back home! There are five more animals 
to rescue before the zoo can open. Wow, so we saved one, guys. We did it. We rescued our first animal. Yay. Okay, well, let's head back out. And, well, if we have the log, we can probably save the giraffe next. But let's, let's go back up and see if I'm missing something. We didn't head this way, so let's go this way, too. Just to make sure we see everything we need to see in the grasslands. Oh, oh! Little Messiah isn't always so sure on her hooks. Oh, no. I hope she hasn't gotten into trouble. It's Mama Giraffe! Excuse me, Mrs. Giraffe. If you're looking for Masai, I've already found her! Yeah! Oh, wonderful! Where is my little girl? She's on the other side of a drawbridge that's stuck open. But I think I can save her. Yeah! I do hope so. Wow. And tell her Mommy's waiting! Wow! Well, don't worry, Mama Giraffe! We're gonna get her right now! Well, I I'm, I'm glad I could make her feel a little better. Okay, let's head out. And let's see here. We're gonna go back into the jungle land. And back over. Here we go. And whee! <laughs> okay, and she was over this way. Oh, but I needed to, to put the log in the raft on the other side. Okay, let's try that first. Oh, don't worry, I'll be there soon. Okay, we're heading this way. We're going past the uh, boa constrictor mama. And, okay, here we are, back at the raft. So let's take the log and put it in the raft. That looks there, better. There, the raft is fixed. Now Pep and I can go safely up the river. Okay, let's head up the river. Hot ziggity, <laughs> this is fun. Yeah, let's go. So this way? Oh, look, we're, we're Oh, cool! It's like we need a propeller! I can't believe my rotten luck! What happened, Mr. Hippo? Yo! What's up? Excuse me, is this where Zanzibar lives? Yeah, it is! But he ain't here! Oh, no. He got lost somehow! Maybe I can find Zanzibar! Oh, if you could, I yeah. really owe you big time! I miss the little rascal! Oh. I'll sure do what I can! Yeah! That's a tongue, butt butt! I'm counting on you. Of course, Daddy Hippo. Well, let's see. Do we want to go towards the rapids or up the river? Let's go up the river more and see where that leads. So we're heading up and... Oh, no, who's that? Oh, man. I hope somebody helps me. Oh, no, it sounds like he needs help. We'll come back next time and we'll help out this little guy. Uh, it was fun playing with you. Bye. with Pokemon! We just got our score bunny. His name is Matches. And we just had a cool little barbecue, so I'm ready to see what's next on the next day. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two getting along all right? Understanding one another? Maybe even building up a bit of love? Of course I have, Lee! Eve's made fast friends with this score bunny, too! Oh, that's awesome! Uh, listen up, new trainers. I believe believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. What are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the one who will be coming to challenge you. If you think he might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. But I'm not planning to lose to him and miss out on my chance to beat the unbeatable champion! Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to be first rate in battle, too! Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if he's up for it. What do you say? Willing and ready to take Hop on in the first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Well, that's really intimidating, but he's my friend and I and my, my score bunny is also my friend, so we're gonna go for it! Believe in your partner Pokemon and care for them too with all your heart. Do those two things and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, to have a champion time battling with them. Yeah, it's pretty intense. Oh, so these are battle spots. Okay. Looks like everyone's on board. Pokemon and trainers alike? 
Then let's do this! I've watched every match that Lee's ever had! I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home, too! I know exactly what to do in order to win. We'll see about that, Hop! He's ready to go, though! I'm challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop! Alright, let's get going! He sent out Wooloo! Wooloo! Oh, it's so cute! But matches has this! Pokemon Battle it is then! I've got two partners with me! Oh, I've only got one. Oh, he's so cute! Okay. So, fight and tackle or growl. Well, I'm gonna go with tackle. And let's see what happens. Matches use tackle! Oh uh, yeah, look! We got him pretty good! And Wooloo also used tackle! Oh man. Well, I think we got some more damage on the Wulu. Oh, because I'm level 5 and the Wulu's a level 3. Okay, good. So we use another tackle. Now just use tackle. Oh, look, he got him. All right, and Wulu also used a tackle. Wulu boss up into a little ball. It's so cute. Okay, but we're going to have to tackle it one more time. Okay, Matches just use tackle. And yeah, we got Oh, it's a very cute Pokemon, but I had to do my best. X points. Oh, oh, we leveled up, guys! Wow! So matches grew up to level six. That's awesome! I guess we're pretty good Pokemon trainers. Matches learned Ember. Ooh, okay. It's not over yet. I've added another trusty ally to my team. Pops it out. Grookey! Oh, it's very cute. Okay fight, and I guess we're gonna use Ember. Ooh, it's a different color because it must be a fire move. All right, let's do that. Matches used Ember! Whoa! Oh, that did a lot of damage! Did you already know about type advantages? I guess I, I, I kind of know. <laughs> you opposed Kuki is a burn, and he's gonna scratch me. Oh, he hurt me a little bit, but not that much. Oh, because he was burned, he also got hurt! Okay, so maybe one more Ember, maybe two, we'll see. That is used Ember! Yeah! Oh, we're so close, guys! He's in the red! Okay, and then Grookey used Growl. Okay, matches. Oh, it's close! We got one more! Let's see, we can either do a Tackle, a Growl, or an Ember. Let's do a Tackle this time. Matches use tackle. And yeah, we did it! We took out that Grookey! That's awesome! And we got more experience points! And a whole other level! Matches is at level 7 now. I guess we, will, we must be really good at these Pokemon battles. Two levels in one? Aw, oh, poor Hop. You beat my two Pokemon with your one? You and that score bunny are too much. That's right, we are. We're the best. You got 400 for winning. Oh, so I guess there's money in this game, too. Well, that was a shock. Guess I know now why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon, too. It won't be too bad. Uh, you and your Pokemon all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out Charizard and join in on all the fun. Good enough out there, Score. Good effort out there, Score Bunny. Why didn't I get you all sorted? Why don't I get you all sorted? And Eep, you've got real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him and make the both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen me battle now, Lee, so come on, you've got to let me take on the Pokemon Gyms. You join the gym challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting the cart before the Rapidash there, little brother. If that's really what you want to do, you two have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Eep. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data, you know? It's a record of a, po of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. Right, right, we get it. Pokedex is then. We're on it! Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me! That's the kind of enthusiasm. Yeah, enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to 
are to be the next champion, so completing a single Pokedex will be nothing! Man, Hop's really excited! Just another page in the tale of my legend! You're probably... You probably better go tell your mom that you're heading out, though. I guess I should. Whoa, where'd they go? Well, I guess I'll go say bye to mom. Oh, there he is! Crash. Eep! Did you hear that just now? Wow. Oh, we're back in front of my house! That gate's open, and the Wooloo that was there... Where's the Wooloo? <gasps> the gate's open! And the Wooloo's gone! It was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there? Oh, it definitely did. I definitely think that Wooloo made a break for it. Well, it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state. <gasps> oh, that's not good. And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterwards. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's pretty funny. Eep, what do you say? Uh, yeah, we've got to save it. Right, even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do what's needed. Hope you're ready for anything because we're going in, Eep! Alright, Hop, wait! Man, this guy just jumps ahead of the game, but... Oh, you keep showing up! Okay, well, I guess we're gonna go this way. Slumbering Wheel. I hope I'm saying that right. Let's see. It's so pretty, though. It's so blue. Oh, that blue, where do you think it got off to? I don't know, but I guess we're gonna find out. The fog is really coming in thick now. If we don't find find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble! Oh, he just keeps running ahead! Why can't he just wait for me? Oh, what was that? Oh my gosh! Oh, oh, oh my goodness! It's a Squavit! Go, matches, go! Oh, it's like a little squirrel! It's so cute! Okay, so I've played Pokemon before, and usually you can catch them. But I don't think I have any Pokeballs. So I guess we're just gonna have to fight this this little squirrel friend. So I guess let's start with an ember. Matt just used ember! Oof! Oh, that was really powerful! It caught him down by half! Alright, he tackled me, but it didn't really hurt. So let's use another one of these embers. Oh, it's so cute though! Oh, there it goes! Alright. Oh, he fainted. Don't worry, little friend. I'll come back and catch you. I promise. Pokemon gain more experience points? Well, we get to eight? No, I guess not. But Squirt Bunny did a great job. Good job, matches. Let's keep going here. Oh, hey, Hop. Okay, then we're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going here. Uh, I don't see anything. Oh! Ah! Ah! All right. Whoa! A wild rookie. It's like a little birdie! Oh, he looks kind of mad, though. He's really cute. Oh, yeah, and all the Pokemon I've seen so far are just so cute! Okay, we're gonna try a tackle this time. Matches use tackle! Whoa, that was great! Rookity used the leer! Oh, alright, I wonder what that did. Oh, Matches' defense went down. Well, I don't think that's gonna get in the way of me doing another tackle! Matches use tackle! Yeah! A critical hit! That means it did extra damage! Sorry, friend, but we're finding our friend Wooloo! We got some expert points. Okay. Let's keep going. Good job, matches! Alright, let's keep heading through. Where it... What was that? Did you hear that? That Was that a Pokemon crying out, you think? It definitely was. You have great ears, too, Hop. Oh, okay, so I guess we're gonna keep going. Hello? Oh no! Man, I keep running into all these Pokemon. Oh, look at him! He's so cute! Oh man. I really want to start catching all these Pokemon, but I don't have any Pokemons yet, so... We're gonna use Ember here. See what that does. Then we're gonna do a tackle. Oh, didn't get him down to halfway that point, but... Oh! He did a little tail whip! His tail's so poofy, too! Oh, this is a girl one! Okay, okay, so let's do a fight and we're gonna tackle. You got this, matches! Alright, aw, oh, yeah! Oh, we're getting close! Oh, we did it again! Alright, let's see. Let's see, I think we got this. We're gonna do a fight and another tackle. 
We're gonna get you! We're gonna get you! Yeah, we got him! All right, we're getting so many experience points, guys! Matches is just getting stronger and stronger! I'm surprised we haven't seen that Wooloo yet, though. Okay, we're gonna keep going, and now we're gonna go this way. Oh! There was that noise again! Come on, Eve, that Wooloo might be in real trouble! Uh, I am, I'm just kind of scared, Hop. Wait! You never wait for me. That's kind of rude, but I guess we are trying to save a friend. Wow, it is, it is really misty here. I can barely see in front of me. Hello? Oh, there he is, there's Hop. This is mad! I can't even see my own hand in front of my face! Yeah, it is really misty! Uh, I think I get now why this place is off limits. Yeah, it's real foggy. What's that? What's going on? Oh, wow, it's really hard to see. Whoa! What is that? What is that? What the? My, my thoughts exactly, Hop! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! What is that? Um, okay, matches. We're we're fighting this? I don't know what it is! I don't even know what level it is! It's got some cool brains though. Um, I guess we're gonna do an ember. Okay. What? What? It has no effect! It went right through that thing! What? That move had no effect on it. Uh, maybe I can tackle it? Let's try that. Ah! Uh, again! It has no effect! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, what is he doing? I can barely see! Uh, Eepa, I can't see anything! You okay? No! I have no idea what's going on. Maybe we can growl at it. Let's try that. I just use growl. What? The move had no effect! Those are the only moves I know! Whoa, whoa, I can't see! I can barely see anything! Matches, no! Matches, where are you? I can't see anything either! Whoa! Who said that? Is it me? Was it Hop? Was it that weird Pokemon? What's going on? Oh, whoa, whoa! Trees? Oh, okay, we got some trees. And, and, oh, I'm, I'm asleep on the ground! What happened? That was wild! Hop, hop, what's going on? Uh, Leon, Eep! Uh, Leon, hop, Eep! So Leon's here now? What? Oh, what? Lee, how do you manage to find your way here? Yeah, you're, you're, you're pants with directions! You almost get, you always get lost! Oh, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two, and you never showed. Of course I came to look for the both of you. Wait, wait, where's the Wooloo? We we're trying to rescue that Wooloo! Ah, oh, Leon took care of it. Meh! The little chap's just fine. Though all you had fainted by the- All of you had fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds, but it took courage to come in here all the same, and I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. Well, at least that Wooloo's alright. Yeah, Eep? Yeah, I mean, that's... We're all about the Wooloo's here. Uh, I thought he, we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attacked? But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? Uh, it seems loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. It just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really, I'm, they did it and I couldn't do anything with matches. They, they seemed to pass right through it. Your moves passed right through it, huh? So, the fearsome Pokemon, they say, live in the slumbering weald. Are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. For now, let's simply get out of this place. You, you'll all be all right now that I'm here with you. All right. Even if we didn't get an earful from Lee, what an experience! This will make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. All right, Hop, but I guess it's my legend too. 
Uh, don't forget to tell your mom we're off to Wedgehurst now. She'll go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. Alright, I'll go say bye to my mom, but you guys better wait up for me. Alright, back to the house. Let's see. Mom! Mom, are you home? Sorry, Munchlax, you're not my mom. Mom! Oh, there you are. Well now, isn't Score Bunny just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? Yeah, that's right, Ma. Alright, here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. <gasps> An allowance! Thanks, Mom! Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Score Bunny will battle to the very end for you. Aww, cause he's my friend! So don't you go pushing that poor deer too hard. Oh, I won't. Ah! Oh, he's so cute. And you, Score Bunny, look after my little Eep. Oh, my mom really loves me. Come home to rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. Oh, that's a really cute saying. Thanks, Mom. All right, that was super cool. So I guess what we're going to do is head to Wedgehurst in the next episode. Uh, see you then, guys. Bye. Uh, our Wooloo, Baba, just finished a battle with a Swovet that fell out of a tree. So we're going to see if we can pick up all those berries we, we uh, managed to knock out of the tree before the Pokemon fell. Matches wants to learn the move Double Kick. Should an old move be forgotten and replaced with Double Kick? Yeah, why not? Let's see. There's Tackle, Growl, Ember, Quick Attack, and Double Kick. The target is quickly kicked twice in succession using both feet. Well, that sounds awesome. Let's get rid of Growl. I don't think we've used it once. One, two, and ta-da! Matches forgot girl, and he learned double kick! All right, we're making progress. Other Pokemon took all the orange berries away. What? So I guess if you like, you scoot a tree a little bit, but then a Pokemon falls out, you don't get all the berries you shook out of it. Can I shake it again? But there are no berries, oh, I guess not. Okay, oh, I think those are wing all over there. What's that? Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just being real sneaky. Let's see. Oh! A Bunnelby! Very cute. Well, you know what this means. We gotta catch it! Yes, it is raining. Um, ooh, it's kind of strong, too. It's a level 10. Let's do a tackle. Bunnelby, use tackle! Oh, it uses its ears to fight. That was actually kind of strong. I don't know if Baba can handle this one. Let's try somebody else. So the Bunnelby is a 10. So let's send out... Oh, yeah, Molar fainted. Let's send out Sunny. No, no, Matches just got a cool new move. So we're going to put Matches in. Baba, come back. Matches! Wait, this... <gasps> I didn't realize it's a bunny versus a bunny! Matches, you're gonna have to show this guy who's boss! Okay, so we're gonna fight, and we're gonna use Ember! We have to show him who's the better bunny! That wasn't very effective at all. Huh. Maybe we should try the double kick. I'm afraid it might hurt this thing too much, but let's try. Oh my goodness! Okay, so I guess Bunnelby is weak to that move. Well, I guess we'll have to try and catch another one. I guess everybody, some people leveled up. Oh man. Well, let's 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 check out this Wingle. A wild Wingle, very cute. Okay, let's see if a, a tackle will do okay here. You got him. Oh, he quick attacked Baba. Well, that didn't go super well. I think I need to do some switching again. You know, let's try Mary. Mary's pretty cool. Okay, let's see. You're in charge, Mary. Work, work. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. He's quick attack. All right, that wasn't very powerful, so maybe... 
Let's, so Nuzzle's kind of strong. Let's use Tackle. Use Wiggle, use Growl. Brr. All right, okay. Mary's attack fell. Mary used Tackle. All right, that wasn't bad. We'll do another one, and then we'll get it in the yellow, and we'll be able to use a Pokeball. That didn't hurt at all. All right, awesome, we're in the yellow now. We're gonna go to the bag, and we're gonna grab a Pokeball. Okay, fingers crossed. Will we catch the Wingle? Please? Yay, we caught it, okay. That's awesome. So a Wingle is like a seagull. Oh, and then people gain extra points. Okay. Um. All right, Pokedex. The Wingle's title was added to the Pokedex. It makes its nest on sheer cliffs, riding the sea breeze. It glides up into the ever expansive skies. So peaceful. Yes, we have to nickname every single one of our Pokemon. So this one's a boy, and he likes to fly. So we're gonna call him Airplane, because airplanes also fly. Air P -lane. There we go, there's the A, there's the N, and E. Awesome, okay, Airplane! Where do you want to send Airplane? Airplane's gonna go to the box. I like our party as it is right now. All right, that was super cool. What's this over here? Huh, let's check it out. The pillars of red light you see in the wild air are marked Pokemon dens. Dynamax Pokemon dwell in these dens and you'll be able to battle them by investigating the den. You can start the battle on your own or get up to three other players to help you out. That's pretty cool. There's a bit of energy trickling out of the den. You gain 50W. What's, what? Can I not go inside? It doesn't seem to be anything in the den. Oh, okay. Well, let's see if we can get this Bunnelby. Hey, bud! Oh, it's so cute. Okay, we're gonna try our best to catch this one. And I keep forgetting to switch Bob out. Okay, uh, we'll do switch and... Not matches, because matches did a, did, didn't... Wasn't very helpful last time. So, we're gonna go with Mary. Mary, I'm gonna have you do a nuzzle. Ow! That one hurt! Okay, let's see. Nuzzle. Let's see where it goes. Well, I'm gonna use Quick Attack. Alright, Mary used Nuzzle. That was not very effective, but the Bunnel Bee is paralyzed, which I know is good for catching Pokemon. So we'll try a tackle. Bunnel Bee used Quick Attack. Oh, okay. Mary used Tackle. This is this is not working in my favor. Okay, let's see. Maybe let's try Roxy. You know what? Let's try matches, and we'll just make sure not to use the double kick. So matches, you're up. All right, looking good. So ready to go. Well, okay. Fight, and we're going to use. We'll use Quick Attack since this one seems to be pretty speedy. Matches use Quick Attack. All right, that's what we wanted. Okay, so we we've done this. We're gonna try one of our Pokeballs. There we go. Use this item. Use the Pokeball. Let's go. Let's get him. Oh, I think we got it. I'm feeling pretty good. You got it. We got it. Awesome! So every Pokeball we've thrown, we've managed to catch catch the Pokemon with, which is good. Baba grew up a little bit. Everyone's looking good. All right. Okay. Bunnelby's dad was added to the Pokedex. It excels at digging holes. Using its ears, it can dig a nest 33 feet deep in one night. Wow, that's really long. Uh, right. We have to give this Bunnelby a name. So this is a girl. So we're gonna name her Barbara. Or maybe just Barbie. Yeah, we'll name her Barbie. B A R B I E. There we go. Bunnelby, Barbie the Bunnelby. Okay. Uh, oh no, I didn't want to add her to my party. I'm sorry. I want to send her to the box. Well, maybe I should. No, no, we'll send her to the box. Okay, there we go. 
So we've caught every Pokemon we've seen so far, which is good. <gasps> oh, but it's probably too powerful. Uh, after we ran into that Onyx, I don't want to have that happen again. What's that? <gasps> oh, hi, friend. Oh, did someone drop it here? Use the right stick to rotate the camera while you're in the wild area. And if you press the right stick, you can find a way to see why you have things. Press the L button to look straight ahead again. Okay. Whoa! Hey, bud! This one looks like a pigeon! A P-Dove! It is like a pigeon! Okay, you know what this means, guys? Is we've never seen it before. It's new. We gotta catch it. Okay, it's a level 10. It's a girl. Let's use... Oh, we haven't tried Copycat yet. Let's see what that does. Baba, use Copycat! But it fit. Oh. Gust. Oh, man. Okay. Uh. Well, Baba isn't doing great. So let's try. Roxy! We might have to set up camp soon. I think that's what I'll try to do next. Because they, they said something about being able to, like, raise. Not raise your Pokemon, but keep them healthier. So we'll try that out. Roxy's defense fell. We're gonna fight, and we're gonna do beat up. Wapito views for the tank. Oh my goodness! That was terrible! Um. Well, beat up's doing okay, but Roxy isn't gonna make it through this one too good. We should probably switch her out. Roxy was. Hit, she hit five times. Oh, uh, maybe we should use a different Pokemon! You know, matches is so great! Maybe we need to put him back out. Let's see. Okay. Um, go matches! Matches is probably having a hard time in this weather, too. Because cause he's a fire type, and it's raining out, and do we want to do the double kick? Let's do the quick attack. Let's try that, because we want to try and, like, catch this thing, not kill it. Okay, great! That's all we needed! You, you did great, matches! Just, just hold in there! Hold in there! It'll be okay. We'll catch him, and and then we're gonna set up camp, and things will be fine. Use the Pokeball. Boop. Okay. I don't know. I'm kind of nervous about this one, guys. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, we got her. Pedo was caught. Let's see. Your Pokemon gains some more points. Everybody levels up a little bit. Fantastic. Mary grew to level 10. Mary learned bite. Good job, Mary. You and Mole are both no bite now. Let's see. Pedo's data was added to the Pokedex. Where people go, these Pokemon follow. If you're scattering food for them, be careful. Several hundred of them can gather at once. Oh, they're just like real pigeons. Okay, so would you like to give Pedo a name? Yes, I would. Well, she's a pigeon, so she, she needs to be named Pidge. So let's see, P, I, D, G, E. Her name is Pidge! Okay, awesome. Where do you want to send Pidge to? She's got to go to the box. Pidge's been sent to the box. Great! Okay, so can I, can I set up my camp here? Can I just do that? Uh, polka doll, cherries, TM, honey. And fishing rod endorsement, wishing star, Dynamax band, camping gear. You seem to hear echo in your head. Eep, dear, this isn't time to use that. When can I go camping? What's the Y do? Oh my goodness, what was that? I didn't even see that. A Tyrogue? He, he just attacked me out of nowhere. Wow. That was kind of scary. All right, well... <laughs> Baba isn't doing too hot. Matches is in bad sorts. Everyone is in bad sorts except for Sunny. Uh, I guess we'll just use Baba. And we'll do Tackle and hope for the best. Tyro used Helping Hand, but it failed. Okay, Baba used Tackle. All right, that was great, Baba. If we can do one more and then throw a Pokeball, we should be in good shape. Okay. Okay, great, great. No more injuries. Baba, you can do it. I believe in you. Oh, okay, good. So we're going to grab a Pokeball, and we're going to use the Pokeball. And I use the Pokeball. Okay, I think we're going to catch this guy. He snuck up on me, but we're going to sneak up on him. Yeah, we caught him. Tyrogue was caught. So 
Let's see. Everyone gained some experience points. Match is leveled up. That's what I like to see. Let's see. Okay. Terusau is out of the Pokedex. It is always bursting with energy. To make itself stronger, it keeps on fighting even if it loses. Oh, that's such a good spirit. Would you like to give a nickname? Of course I would. So he's a fighter. And he is a, 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 a determined spirit. Oh, I have an idea. We're going to name him after our friend Hop. Because Hop seems really determined. So now they're pals. Uh, we're going to send it to the box. Send it to the box. And oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I think we're gonna have to run from this P-Dove. Not, not that you aren't doing great, Baba, but we're in bad sorts. Yes, it is raining. And we're gonna run away? Uh, oh! Baba has apparently a special ability that makes it easier to run away? That's really good to know. So because of that, and because of how weak some of everyone is, we're gonna put Sunny up front. And I guess we're going to look for somewhere to camp? I don't quite know what else to do. It's a bit of energy trickling out of the den. Okay, we got some stuff there. Is there anything over here? Okay, I don't... Guys, I don't know where I can camp. They mentioned it, but I haven't seen anything about that yet. Oh, that was a noise. Oh no, don't follow me! I already caught one of you! I don't need to do any more fighting! Uh, we'll go this way... And maybe there's something over here? Oh, we don't want to get... Oh, shiny! I'm gonna pick that up. A tiny mushroom! A very small and rare mushroom. It's popular with a certain class of collectors. Cool! Okay, so the ones with these beams have Pokémon inside, but my Pokémon are not doing too great. Westlake Axwell Wild Area. So, we went into a different area? Why is it spooky? It seems kind of spooky. I'm scared. Oh! Oh! Oh, that looks so cool! I kind of want to catch it, but... I also think I need to, like, find somewhere to rest? Okay, well, well, we'll head this way. What's that? Did you see something? Oh, another Pokemon. I'm just so weak. I don't want to fight anything. Okay, we're gonna keep- we're gonna see if we can get around there to the other side. And maybe there's a Pokemon? Uh, oh! Maybe there's like a Pokemon Center over there? I just keep getting distracted. This whole area is so cool. Okay, let's uh, we're gonna keep going. And we're gonna grab some energy out of here. Which I still quite don't know what that does. Uh, I don't want to talk to anyone because I don't want to get into any battles. That might be a bit much for me. I, I'm i very curious where we can camp, though. I would really like to camp. Oh my gosh. Uh, the wild area is overflowing with special sort of energy measured in watts. You can gather watts yourself from glowing Pokemon dens and glowing Pokemon in the wild. You'll also find trainers in the wild area who are willing to give you all sorts of items if you'll just give them some of your watts. Interesting. So it's like energy, I guess. Wow, look at look at all those people. But I really just want to heal my Pokemon. Man, this place is huge, though. Maybe I should. Uh, uh, let's see. Pokemon camp. Oh, the camp is right here. I missed it when I was looking through. <gasps> We're camping. In your Pokemon camp, you and your Pokemon can play together and even eat together growing closer through the experience. If your Pokemon grow very close to you, they may even try extra hard for you during battle. You can play using your Joy-Con too if you slide your Joy-Con off your system. Well, I'm playing with a Pro Controller, but I guess we can waggle things with the Poke Toy. When you set up camp in the wild area, you'll be able to play with up to three other trainers at a time. Oh, so we can play with friends. That's pretty cool. <gasps> you can't use communication features. Here. Okay, that's, that's fine. Um... Look, all my friends are out, though! Hey, guys! Can I call you? Hey! Hey, Matches! Yeah, come here! Yeah! Hi! <gasps> Matches seems to be worried about its surroundings. Oh, well, let's chat! Matches seems tired and hungry. Tell me more! Matches looks like he wants more attention. Well, let's, uh, go play! I wonder what that means. 
Oh, hey, what? Where'd you go? Uh, toy? Oh, cooking! Let's do some cooking. Cooking up a fine curry while out camping by selecting ingredients and berries of your liking. Your curries will be more delicious the more things you put in them. Once you start cooking, fan the flames with your fan to keep things hot enough and stir things up with your ladle to keep them moving. Only don't go overboard, you don't want to spill. The last step will be to add a bit of soul into it at just the right timing and you'll be making a masterpiece for your Pokemon to enjoy. After you finish cooking, it'll be time for everyone to dig in together. Eating a tasty curry can have a number of effects on the Pokemon that are at your camp, including restoring their HP and making them feel more friendly towards you. I guess we're gonna start cooking! We gotta try! So we've got, uh, as a distinct flavor... Why don't we do one of everything? We'll do one, one cherry berry, one orange berry, and one pickle berry. Yeah, now we're ready. Would you like to start cooking? Yes, I would. Okay, what do we do? Uh. Hey. Okay, we're fanning the flames. They're getting real hot. We're pressing it as fast as we can. We're doing it. We're doing it. Oh, the pot is steaming. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, I'm pressing it as fast as I can. We're doing it. I want to do it faster. We're going to do it as fast as we can. Okay. Give it a good swirl. Okay. We're rotating. We're rotating. We got it. Okay. Oh, am I doing it too much? I don't know. It's looking pretty sparkly. It's looking pretty good. I'm having a good feeling about this, guys. Okay, sparkle it more. Faster. Put your heart into it, eh? Oh, I wasn't paying attention. You have to do it like in Pokemon Go. Okay. Done. All right. Is it tasty? <gasps> All of my friends are going to have some. But spicy curry. Ooh. Oh, look, it's me and Sunny. Is it good? Do we like it? <gasps> Everyone seems really happy. Delicious. Lava Fit class. Oh. Restored by half. Gained a few experience points. Sunny and the rest of your party got friendly towards you. That seems really nice. That was super cool getting to cook with some of our Pokemon. Well, come back soon and we'll see what else we can do with them. Bye! Hey everybody, Eat the Mouse here with my friend Mary. Hey guys. And we're playing some more of Overcooked 2. We just beat the second level and we're on to the third. You ready, Mary? I'm super ready. Let's go. All right. Okay. I what do you think we're gonna make this time? Um, I'm thinking something with sushi and rice. Yeah. But not a sushi roll. Maybe like a, a sushi bowl or maybe. Or, or what what else can you get when you get sushi? Hmm. I, oh! Oh! Dirty plates. We're gonna have to Are clean. we just on wash duty? I guess we have to clean our plates now. Hmm, well, all right, let's get to it. Ugh, they're adding so many steps each level. I know, I, I can't imagine what it's gonna look like on level six. Oh no. Okay, so our first one is sushi with a cucumber. I have a cucumber here. Okay, chop up that cucumber and I'm going to cook up some of this sushi rice. Got it. And then we're gonna need some of the wrappers, so I'm gonna grab one of- Here's oh, no. your cucumber. Okay, let's put it on a plate. Pick a plate, any plate, any, there we go. That one's good. And there we go, and the rice is good. You want, I'm gonna grab the rice. I'm gonna chop up the shrimp. Oh, don't burn rice, don't burn. Come on, don't start a fire this time. I know, I gotta be better. Okay, uh, okay, the rolls are done. The rolls are done. Shrimp right. is done, shrimp is done, okay. I'll serve this one. Okay, good, great. Oh no, I'm not bringing it to the guy, I gotta bring it to the conveyor belt. I always get him confused. <laughs> Okay, cool. All right. I need a plate. Oh no. Uh, uh. Where are uh, the plates? Oh, we have to clean the plates. Hold on. Oh Where no. Where the dirty plates are? Where are the dirty plates? Oh, there's some clean plates here. Uh, I don't see where any dirty plates are. Okay. Um, rice, and we need the rice for the next roll. Okay, so I'm. I'm where are these? Yeah, we need to wash our plates now. Oh, here's the dirty plates. I'll get started. Oh, on those. okay. Cool, cool, cool. I'm gonna grab this cucumber. And I'm gonna put it over here. But first, I'm gonna make sure this rice doesn't burn, because I don't want that happening again. So okay. we've got some cooked rice. It's on this plate, and this goes here. And uh, okay, all of the dishes look pretty good. The plates are in the sink, but I'm not sure how to wash them. Try pressing X, maybe. Uh. Huh. 
Huh. Oh, I think they're clean, maybe? They look clean. I just don't know how to get them out. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, uh. Oh, no. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you we go. It. Perfect. Okay, we're delivering another order. And we're making the next one. I need some rice and I'm gonna... I'm you gonna... work on the sushis and I'll work on the shrimps. Okay, cool. Well, I took a shrimp out and I'm getting the rice over here. Okay, perfect. That I rice. got these plates. Okay, perfect. Put them out over there and I'm gonna put a bunch of stuff that needs to be chopped. Okay. Let me work I on think... this plate. Okay, and we got some rice. Okay, some rice on a plate. And I think we... Oh man, that one's running out. Uh, I gotta chop this up. Okay, right. I think we're good on the plates, Mary. Let's All right. do some chopping. All right. Oh, uh, you wanna grab me a wrapper? A wrapper? Sure. Yeah. And put it on that one and... Oh, no, oh, no, I put it on the wrong one. Oh, no. Ah, 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 no. Ah, ah. Okay, okay, oh, okay. No, okay, okay. We got it, we got it, I got it. We got this, I got this. Ah, <laughs> I can't pick it up. Mary, what's going on? I don't know, Eve. Okay, okay, I, I sent one out, okay. Uh, All right, I got this shrimp. Okay, cool, great. Um... I'm gonna grab this rice and I'm gonna cook up some of the rice. We just sent out a shrimp. What? Okay. This is. I don't want to aggravate my customers, but these shrimps are. They seem like they're mad because this shrimp has been. It's been a while, but oh. Uh, we may have aggravated was, a customer. Yeah, but this one was so much harder. We got two stars this time, which isn't isn't bad. Hey, we had to wash our plates. We had to include both level one and two. I think we did pretty well. You know, you're right, Mary. We're we're learning and we're doing a good job. Yep. I can't wait to see what this next one is. I wonder what else we're going to have to do. Yeah, I don't know what else there is to add, but it seems like they're adding something every level. Yeah. I wonder what we're going to learn. Maybe maybe we're going to cook more than like sushi. <gasps> Ooh. Whoa. Hidden levels. Hidden levels. They're unlocked by secret criteria in another level. Switches. Discover switches to raise ramps and reach other places. Okay. Interesting. Do you want to go to the secret area or to level four? Whichever one you want, Eep. You're what? the one driving the bus. Oh, man. Let's check out the hidden area. Whoa. Your bus oh. is on a, on a raft? Uh, oh. Oh. Whoa. Activated some some of those maybe we can get in on this side i like that like this map is also kind of its own level yeah it's its own game almost yeah okay so here's our secret level awesome Let, let's play this one might be kind of tough though mary are you ready <sighs> ready as i'll ever be oh, all right we'll see what happens it looks like from the loading screen that there's meat maybe meat or mixers I'm not sure. This is going to be interesting. Yes, indeed. So we're doing sushi and flour. Mix some flour and steam together. Hmm. All, All right. right. We'll figure it out as we go, I guess. All right. Okay. Oh, so we're separated by sides. So I've got a mixer and choppers and meat. I've got the fish. Okay. So uh, if you put the fish on that side. Oh, you have a chopper too. Okay. So. Should I chop it first? Yeah, I think I chopped it first. Okay, so I chopped mine, and I have to put it on a grill, but the grill is on your side, so there's some meat for you. And Thank you. I'm going to need some flour from you when you can, and I can mix the flour and cook it. I think I have to chop this before? No, it's already chopped, so why? Oh, no! My fish! Oh, my great! Fish. <laughs> no, 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 no! You can do it! You can do it! Okay, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, cool. So, Matt, how, what do we do? What do we do? My, it says that the meat doesn't have to, oh, it goes on that grill. Got it. So, I have this meat that I cooked. I'm not, I think, I think I may have messed up. I think I may have messed up too. Okay, okay. Uh, so I threw out my gross meat. You want to pass me some flour? I'll put, sure. put it in this bowl here, and then I'll pick up the bowl, and we can mix it. All right. Okay. All right. I'm going to mix up this flour. Oopsies. I am so confused. Me too. Maybe maybe we shouldn't have done the hidden level first. Yeah. Okay, so we're mixing that up. Needs plate. Uh, put it on a plate. Let's see oh, what Oh, darn happens. it. We here got we go. this. Okay, cool. You did it. All right, all right. I can send it out. Okay, I've got the flour. The flour is good. Can I put the flour on a plate? Oh, take the flour from me. Where would you like me to put it? Uh, in the steamer, I think. 
I don't know what this steamer is. Uh, maybe. Oh, put, put, put the meat in it. Put the meat in it. Maybe it needs meat. Oh, put the meat in it. Okay, I'll put it over here. Okay. Oh, no, I dropped it. Oh, that's okay. I didn't know you're able to drop stuff now. Yeah, there's a lot going on here. I'm very confused. Okay. Maybe. maybe. Okay, oh, the it... meat's in it. Okay, now take it and put it in the steamer. Yeah, you got it. Oh no, remind me what the steamer is again. Uh, it's the, the brown thing behind you. Oh, that yeah. thing. Yeah. Put it in there. It doesn't go in there. What do you mean it doesn't go in there? Bring it back know. to me. Give it back to me. Here, here, here. <laughs> this is so confusing. This is so oh, confusing. Oh, I think I need I a keep mixer for it. <laughs> okay. Oh uh, my. This is a lot. Okay. This is a lot. We're, I'm mixing it now. It's mixing. We're figuring it out. Oh no, we have some aggravated customers. Uh, I, I think we're going to have a lot of aggravated customers this time around. Yep. Okay. Try mixing that one now. Uh, or putting it in the steamer when you get a chance. I'm going to cut up some more meat, I guess. I have no idea okay. what's going on, Okay, Mary. this one's ready. Okay. And we got to put it on a plate. Cool, and then you can take it over. If you have any dirty plates you want to clean, just pass them over. So take this weird mixture here and, and steam it in one of the baskets on the stove. Oh, my gosh. Did you throw it out? I just threw it out. I guess we're gonna have a lot of aggravating customers. We should try this level again sometimes, because I think we're only just starting to figure it out. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna put some meat in this bowl. You wanna put some rice in this bowl for me, Mary? Sure. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm gonna cut some more meat, I guess. Lots of meat. Okay, oh, okay, perfect. Now I'm gonna put that in the rotating thing. What are those called, mixers? Yeah, they're mixers. Oh my, we only have nine seconds. Uh, I don't think we're gonna do very well here, Mary. No. Nope. I think we learned a lot, but we couldn't get it done in time. Oh my, We made well? We made negative $30. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Whoops. Um, so that wasn't our best level. Maybe we should stick to the actual levels, not the surprise ones. I think that's a really good idea, Mary. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye!